what's up people so we're back with another video hope you all been staying safe and staying free and had a good week ready for this weekend now this one that i'm bringing to you all today for friday is series one episode two of the prison cooking show so let's get into it so today we're going to be whipping up in the kettle the rice along with the meatballs now what you want to do is is preheat the kettle as we have done and we're going to bust it open chuck in our meatballs but don't put too much water inside of the kettle otherwise it's going to make your stuff all soggy and you don't want to be eating soggy food like that so we're going to bust this open and we're going to slap it in here as you can see i'll show you all bang it in there like that and you can see it's preheated there chuck that to the side and then we're just going to bang it down cover it and then we're going to flick the switch down and then what we're going to do is just open up the rice while that's cooking up in there like so and you always have to cook that meat a, a little bit you know longer than your rice or your pasta rule number one now in any prison that you're in you can get salt and pepper and it doesn't matter what prison you're in all over the world you can get salt and pepper now as that's been boiling and cooking off in there we're going to flip it down just one more time and we're going to break this in half and add it in at the same time and as we've chucked in the rice as you can see we're going to pop that down flick it down again now inside the prison you modify the kettle so obviously you don't have to keep on flicking it but it's still the same principle of cooking it inside of a kettle and what we're going to do is bust it open give it a little swirl around make sure the rice and the meatballs is cooking like so and then while that's cooking inside what we're going to do not to forget we're going to bang it down one more time the salt and lift it like that put that little bit more salt in there and a little bit of pepper for the taste buds and then we're going to flick it down one more time and quickly clean up the plate We're going to lift it back up and then we're going to swirl it around like so. Smell good, eh? Bring back memories though. And inside of prison, you can get your rice and your, meat, your meatballs off the canteen list. Or you can get it from someone that works down in the kitchens. The perks of working in the kitchen. And I'm just going to bang it down one more time just to make sure everything's cooking up in there properly. And then we're going to empty the water. lift it back up, twirl it back around again, make sure that rice is cooked down on the bottom, like so, and that rice is looking about cooked to me, so we're going to drain out the rice. Since we've drained out the water, we're going to bang it down one more time and slap just a little bit more salt and pepper in inside like that. As you all can see there, like so, and give it a little stir. And then just flick it down one more time if you want to, just to be, you know, make sure everything... Mm. So when you bite through the meatballs, you know that it's fully cooked and the rice ain't all dry and dead up like so. And then what we're going to do is just let that steam out for a hot sec. And then we're going to pour it out. Just give that a little second there. You see, like now, I was saying to you, flick it down so many times. But like I said, inside a prison, the kettle will be modified 
and for the next episode i'll make sure that i'll go and get another kettle but like i say same principles as long as you're cooking inside of a kettle there's no other way or form of cooking inside a prison yes you do get microwaves inside of the serveries but once that servery is shut you can't go in there and cook none so what we're going to do we're just going to empty it out onto the plate like so and you know you've got it right when you've got the coloring of the rice looking exactly like that with the sauce inside too and this is how you know when it's cooked and big turkey be eating it all the way through beautiful I could taste the salt the pepper is the rice as well i don't want to burn off my mouth So do drop a like, do drop a comment, subscribe to the YouTube channel if you want to see more prison videos. Do stay safe and stay free.